Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to show you how to install Sentient for the first time and import the dummy data within three minutes. So your site will look exactly the same as Sentient demo site. First, you need to install the latest version from wordpress.org site into your FTP. If you didn't finish this step yet, we are asking you to read the famous five minute install from wordpress.org site. You will find a link to this article above this video in the documentation. Inside wordpress.org site, scroll down to see famous 5 minute install. Follow these steps. After that, you will be able to log in to your site. I will enter the username and the password. In a previous video, we have discussed how to install Sentient on the FTP, and now I am going to activate it. From Appearance, click Themes. And here you will find all the themes that are available under your site. This is Sentient. Click Activate to activate it. After that, you will get this notice. This theme requires the following plugins. This theme recommends the following plugins. Click Begin Installing Plugins. I will start with Visual Composer. It's a required plugin. I will click Install. Then you will get the notice Plugin Installed Successfully. Click Return to require the Plugins Installer. You will still see Visual Composer as a required plugin, but it installed but not activated. I will click to activate it. I will do the same with Sentient Mega Menu. I will click Install. The plugin installed successfully. I will click Return to Required Plugins Installer. And from there, I will click Activate. I will do the same with Layer Slider. I will click Return to require the Plugins Installer and I will activate Layer Slider the same steps. The last one as required will be Ajax Portfolio. I will click Install. And I will activate it. After that, I will navigate to the dashboard. Ajax Portfolio plugin require another plugin in order to work correctly. I will install and activate it the same way. Now, the next step will be is to make Visual Composer work with all post types and pages. To do so, navigate to Settings and from that click Visual Composer. Make sure to check all post types in order to use Visual Composer inside them. I will click Save Changes. As we can see, the index page is working correctly. There is one page only in the menu, the sample page, hello world as a blog inside my index page, and the footer. Now for people who want to create pages and posts from scratch can start from this point to create a home page, posts, team members, and all required pages. On the other hand, for people who want to install a dummy data so their site will look almost the same as Sentient Demo Site, please follow the steps. First, we should install the WordPress importer. To do so, click Import inside Tools. And then we will choose WordPress. Click Install now. After that, I will click Activate Plugin and Run Importer.
In this step, we want to select the XML file that comes with the theme. I will click Browse, and from XML folder inside the theme folder, I will choose the XML file. After that, I will upload file and import. There is an option for the import author. I will click Admin, and I will check the box to download and import file attachments. This will take around three minutes. So here we go. You are almost done. After importing the XML file, navigate to the menu from Appearance. So I will click Appearance, and after that, I will click the menu. Here you will find the main elements already added as sentient menu. Home, Pages, Blogs, Portfolio, Shortcodes, Features, and Show. I will choose this menu as header menu and save the menu. Now I am going to refresh the index page in order to see the changes. And here you will get your new menu. Please note that you can modify or create a new menu as you wish. And don't forget to see other videos that are related to the menu category from the documentation. Now I am going to choose the home page and to do so from settings, click readings. And here you will see a section for front page displays. Click a static page and from front page select home page 01. After that, click Save Changes. Now, refresh the index page, and you will get a, page, a home page almost the same as Sentient Demo Site. As you can see, there is no layer slider in the home page, and that's because we didn't import the content from the layer slider. And to do that, Go to Layer Slider and you will see a section Import and Export Sliders. Click Browse and from the XML folder inside your theme folder, click Layer Slider and select the file. Click Import. Then you will get two sliders, one sentient main that is used in the home pages and one for About Us page. Now I am going to Refresh the page, and that's it. This is the layer slider and the page content. If you have any questions regarding this video, please use our forum on profteamsolutions.com.